Hi, I'm Matt Bay from Restaurant Gordon Ramsay. What inspires me food-wise is the seasons, experiences in life, um, traveling, books, combinations from you know, all over the world or trying different things and trying them to work them together and to sort of see how they, how they come together. Uh, the food style here at Restaurant Gordon Ramsay revolves around seasonality and I think it's always really important. We have a little bit of a classical element running through the dishes. You know, all the lovely fresh produce coming into life, all the lovely colours, the greens, asparagus, morels. Um, it's one of the most inspiring seasons, I feel. A typical dish that's on the menu here at Restaurant Gordon Ramsay right now is uh, Cornish crab with almonds, elderflower and English muffins. We take white crab meat and we bind it with an almond cream, which has then got a dice of globe artichoke through it, which has been dressed with uh, elderflower, some shallots, some salt, and we lightly warm that. And we plate that onto the, into the bowl in a ring, and then on top of that we place our fresh almonds, almond cream, elderflower gel, chive flowers, chive tips, elderflowers, and serve on the side with English muffins and an elderflower velouté. So there we have Cornish crab, almonds, elderflower, English muffins. Typical dessert here on the menu at Restaurant Gordon Ramsay, we have uh, custard tart with Tahitian vanilla, wild strawberries and a basil sorbet. So we take the tart case and we'll place some uh, strawberry gel in the bottom and on top we'll pipe on our uh, Tahitian vanilla custard. Then we will arrange our Gary Getz and wild strawberries which have been lightly macerated in uh, some uh, Fray de Bois and then we arrange those on top and to the side onto one half of the tart followed by some Greek basil and some ruby basil. Uh, then we will canal our basil sorbet and place that on there. So there we have custard tart with Tahitian vanilla, wild strawberries and basil sorbet.